con los ojos fijos en Jesús, hemos querido como familia ponernos a la escucha de los clamores, de los desafíos del mundo actual, de la iglesia y de nuestra propia familia. En nuestras reflexiones hemos individualizado tres caminos que están interconectados y que se reclaman mutuamente. Estos son la sinodalidad, la interculturalidad y la formación. Tres caminos que nos abren a la vida nueva. Que Dieu Trinité nous accorde de refléter son mystère, d'avancer ensemble dans un style synodal, comme compagnon de route qui travaille à Réveau, dans la co-responsabilité. C'est un chemin d'église, de communion, de participation et surtout de mission. We spoke a lot about formation during this our chapter. Formation as discipleship, a way of becoming more and more like Jesus Christ. Also to see formation as a way of interior life, internalizing our life and integrating it in Christ. Not only initial formation, but ongoing formation as well to help us to be closer to God and to improve our relationships with one another. Since formation will help us with universal fraternity, we pray that God will help all of us to put into practice all we have learned and share with our communities. Interculturality is a consciousness of Reciprocal listening, dialogue, acceptance. It's not so easy. It's challenging integration to pass from, from I to us, from myself and to ourself. It's a process going towards a culture, new culture of union, communion, peace and love. e da laici. Insieme cerchiamo cammini nuovi per annunciare alle persone che incontriamo il Vangelo con lo stile semplice e audace della nostra fondatrice, Madre Gerina. Questa nostra testimonianza vuole essere il nostro contributo per costruire una fraternità universale in questo tempo di guerra, soprattutto nell'Europa dell'Est, e anche per dare un calcio 